Welcome to Life One Greenwood. And today I will be decorating this hut. So this is my dining room hutch. And I did a DIY on this uh, trash to treasure. Let's now I'll include that. But what I'm trying to do is try to change out the red and I think I'm going to put some of my blue and white in here for the rest of the holidays and just leave it here. I may just leave it here. Or I don't know. Year round. Who knows? But I'm definitely going to take out the red. If you want to see me decorate the hutch or my dining room cabinet, then please stick around. Thanks, guys. Guys, you'll recall my DIY where I did a trash to treasure and transform these bookcases into um, one, which is now has become my dining room hutch, and two are in the living room, and the third, the fourth has not been painted yet. So I'm gonna decorate this and change out, definitely change out the red. Let's just say that. So I wanna use some of the pieces that I picked up a couple of weeks ago from from Goodwill. They're from Pier 1. These are cute. I like these. So, and they're blue. I, you know what? I just think they, they have like a fall flavor to them because of the pears and apples on here. I mean, they're blue and white, but they just have like a, to me, they have like a fall flavor to them. So, let me see what I can do. I only have four cups. saucers in there playing around with the cups there and I think I need to, a stand so this is just your basic Dollar Tree stand that I'm going to put here excuse my back I'm trying not to give you the back of my head I'm still on the hunt for these the rest of this set I saw some online uh, pieces online and so expensive because you know you, you you can buy them on Amazon again they're from Pier 1 if anybody sees these Pier 1 the pattern is called Melinda but I saw them online um, by Amazon uh, I think it was eBay somebody was selling them and again I think I paid what 50 cents and, and a dollar for these plates and stuff and uh, I'm not gonna pay $10 a plate for something I just paid 50 cents for, but that's that seems to be the going price nowadays. But I'm gonna see. Maybe I'll go for my bigger plate. That's one plate, one plate, one little soup bowl. It's a salad bowl. Okay, I've added one plate there down at the bottom and the two cups. All right, so this is where I am right now with this. I'm 
look at this and see if there's anything else I want to add or if I just want to stay very simple. I brought down a few of my um, blue pieces to add in here, but I'm not so sure I'm, if I want to put anything else in here. So let me look around and decide what I'm going to do and I'll come back and show you how this turns out. On the top shelf, I added a, a soup tureen that I picked up a couple weeks ago from Goodwill. That was going to be my $5 Goodwill challenge, but I changed my mind because I have something else. So let's see. One more thing. Oh, I added some blue balls to the top, the blue ceramic, blue and white ceramic balls to the top. I'll go in closer and show you that. So let's see what else. This is a ceramic owl that I hubby bought for me last year at uh, from Cracker Barrel. So, and I, I did show this in a video. I'll show you, I'll include that video. And I'm wondering if he might not be able to fit like down there on, the, on this shelf or if that'll be overkill. I'll take him out. Let's see if he can fit in there. I'll try a shot like with him there. So that's with him. Let me get a little closer. So it's with my owl there. I may take him out. We'll see. Tell me in the comments, with Al or without Al. Al may be a little bit much. Okay, guys, thank you so much for coming with me as I decorated this hutch. I was so glad to get this blue and white Al. I'm so excited about it. I'm really excited about this. I'm just going to decide if I'm going to leave the Al out. Everything else I'm, I'm okay with. I'm iffy about the owl because I think it might be, might be overkill. It might be blocking things. So, um, I'll let you know. You'll see at the end, I guess, what the final, final picture actually looked like. Let me close it and see. I'm so happy with this little Craigslist find. So let me pull away and see what it's looking like. I'm trying not to show you guys my dining room table because I have a centerpiece on there that I haven't recorded yet. So that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. I may get that, I may get that um, owl out of there. So we'll see. Thank you guys so much for coming and joining me on Life on Greenwood. I'm so excited about this little piece, this little Craigslist piece. And let me have your comments down below with regard to the owl. He might be coming out of there, but we'll see. Thank you guys. Bye now.